Okay, this tree is amazing. Soft, pretty, formal, beautiful. This is the kind of tree that I often say, um, if they had a Christmas tree at Versailles, this should be the tree, don't you think? It's just beautiful and it's rich and it's amazing. Where to start? Okay, number one, let's start at the top with these butterflies. There's a lot of butterflies because we love butterflies, but these are really exceptional. I think these are the most beautiful we've ever offered. You're going to get one of each. You have that soft peachy uh, with the peachy pinks and then that beautiful three-dimensional embellishment that goes all over. Then you're going to get one in a velvety cream with all the beautiful glitter more toward the center, all bordered on clips. You get one of each. Those are amazing. Look how beautiful those butterflies are one and one now i i love those i can't get enough of them i have to say i also love these these are beautiful magnolias and i love how you're going to get a set with both colors so you're going to get this beautiful kind of almost a watermelon hint in the pink and then that beautiful peach that is really a hint of orange and champagne I can't even describe the colors, but I have to say that the colors on both of these. Like apricot. Apricot. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you. Apricot. Um, it is that beautiful hint of apricot, but it's interesting because I think it kind of depends on how the light is hitting it and what's around it. Because I look at this one, and from this angle, it almost looks more peach champagne. But this is the same flower up here, and facing this angle, it looks deeper apricot because the, the light is coming from the side or the light is coming from the front. But the main point is they're really beautiful on a tree, on a garland, really different, really gorgeous, really rich. You're going to love those. Now we also have, speaking of gorgeous and rich, this ribbon. And this ribbon is called the Dubai ribbon. It's done in a soft grayish taupe. Now this color is exquisite. It is not too cool. It is not too warm, but it's going to add the coolness along with the warmth of the gold. So now whatever metallic you want to put it with, I think you're going to be fine. It really kind of has it go with everything. It's four inches wide. It's wired. It's beautiful. It looks like a ball gown. I mean, it is stunning. If you have never really, really had an unbelievable ribbon, I'm not talking about basic. I am talking about exceptional like a couture ball gown red carpet. That's what this ribbon is like. And oh my gosh, does it completely change the entire look and feel of your tree. It's beautiful. By the way, when I invest in ribbon like this, I never cut it, ever. Because I'm gonna use that ribbon for the rest of my life because that's how I am. <laughs> so I think that's how you should think of it. You're gonna use it for the rest of your life and it's gonna be gorgeous. Now, we also have these beautiful weeping willows Look how pretty these are. And you're gonna get one branch that's more gold and clear, and you're gonna get a second branch that has more pink on it. And I'll just kind of show you one of each together. So here is one branch that's gonna have more of the pink, one branch that's gonna have more of the clear, but you're gonna get one of each branch, so you're gonna be gorgeous um, any way you wanna do it. We love these as a tree topper. We put one straight up, put some butterflies on it. We use those kind of draping throughout, but they're really just that gorgeous, drapey, drippy, beautiful, um, glittery. Oh yeah, I love this. Look how pretty. Isn't that gorgeous? And obviously that's a very different look than a traditional branch that just comes out. So we love those. Now we also have these pink berry sprays. These are amazing. The color is stunning. They're glittery, they're sparkly, they're beautiful. They're not heavy, so they're really, really versatile. Those are gonna be absolutely gorgeous on your tree. This, look at these, these beautiful kind of champagne poinsettias with this rose gold berries coming out. Beautiful, beautiful kind of pine needle, long pine needle look coming out. Those are stunning. We use those all over the tree. They even have the beautiful kind of golden leaves, like rose gold leaves behind them. I love those again. Very different, right? Not your usual. Very different, very beautiful. Now, this tree we used a lot of white in because I love white. Um, and I think so many of you do. And I always think it just makes for a really elegant, beautiful tree. We have this European glass ornament with the double poinsettias. These, these are on a mirror silver background and they're beautiful. Six of these in a set, handmade in Europe beginning to end. And these are actually made in the Ukraine. So I love that. Then we have this which is one of my favorite European glass ornaments. It has this frost on the window pane texture, which is what I call it. 
all in white with beautiful little scattered beads of snowflakes and then this gorgeous large snowflake on the front. That's a set of six. Those are made in the Ukraine as well and those are so elegant and so beautiful. Then we have this beautiful white glass ornament and this has kind of a high polished pearl background with silver and then a raised detail almost like little teeny pearls going all the way around all done by hand beginning to end. And all three of these sets of European glass ornaments are actually made in the Ukraine. And I do love that as well. Now, we also have this set of 12 ornaments and these are just fun. These can be on a child's tree. These can be on a formal tree. These can be on a rustic tree, anywhere in between. You're gonna get a dozen, you get a bell, you get a heart and you get the star. And you're gonna have, is that me? Right. That's you. Hello. Hi. It's not a good angle. Um, you're gonna get all 12 <laughs> of these. And these do have just a simple string. So if you want it more formal, just put a hook in the top like we did. If you want it more rustic, use the string, completely up to you, but you're gonna get a dozen of those and those are so fun, I love them. Now this makes the tree. This is an ornament that we had made just specifically for you and I cannot get enough of it. Um, it's a beautiful, beautiful blush with these gorgeous faceted um, kind of pieces of glass. So it almost looks like a disco ball. It's one of my favorite things in the world. I love those more than anything. Then we have, let me see, oh, look at these around the butterfly. Isn't that gorgeous? Did we cover everything on the tree? Kate, oh, thank you. I always forget an ornament and Kate is very good at reminding me of what I forget. Oh, and the pillows too. Okay, so here's a beautiful set of four ornaments. These are handmade glass and they're gonna be a little more substantial. So let me just um, tell you up front that these are going to be better on an artificial tree than a real tree. Um, you're gonna have four of these. You're gonna get two of the onion, two of the round. They're a beautiful ombre, lighter on the top, a little deeper, like a little more champagne on the top, a little more pink on the bottom, really gorgeous, like a mercury glass feel with bronze on the top. I love those, they ground the tree. They are just a little bit more weighty. Um, which can be an issue with the real tree if you want to put it at the end. You've got to put it in a little bit oh. on a real tree. Oh, thank you. Sorry. Um, no, you're right. Kate reminded me something else I'd forgotten, which is the angels. So this is going to be a set of two angels. One is kind of reaching up and back with her beautiful gold wings. I need to get you in that pose. Yes, definitely. <laughs> I think you would be much better at that pose, Kate. And then this is gonna be um, kind of more of a both arms down in motion, <laughs> really beautiful. So I love the angels and I love those on the tree as well. We also have these pillows. This is a set of two pillows. They are so soft. I just wish that you could feel them because they feel so good, you're going to want to just curl up with them. You get one with the silver branches, one with the gold branches. And yes, they're perfect for Christmas, but they're perfect year round. And notice how, we always do different things with pillows, like here we just put a triple wick candle on the pillow. Well, isn't that just a different use for it? Because now it really kind of anchors and holds the candle. You can do the same thing if you want to put a pillow on the floor and put a lantern on it. You've seen us do that a lot. So don't be afraid to use them in ways that are more than just a sofa or a chair, because we love the sofa and the chair, but obviously there's more ways to use it. Look how beautiful when you put this all together. This is all different pinks and peaches and champagnes and taupes and soft golds and silvers and and what it ends up being is an absolutely stunning melange of soft beautiful neutrals so don't think that all your peaches have to match or all your pinks have to match or all your metallics have to be exactly the same you know when you put them together i think it makes them even better oh we also have some of these beautiful gold branches loving these by the way just beautiful gold leaf absolutely gorgeous I always love, that's one of my favorite looks. It's a hint of sparkle with the beautiful soft gold. Here's that poinsettia again with the rose gold berries and branches coming out of it. How gorgeous is that, by the mm -hmm. way? Stunning. And then once again, here's our butterfly with the weeping willow below. Here's a butterfly with the beautiful mirror ball ornaments. Love those. And then we have the prettiest little addition in a tea light holder. So this is a double tea light holder in a golden tone with a tree and a deer and a beautiful wooden base. So you can use regular tea lights in this, um, battery operated tea lights in this. This is gonna be beautiful whether you're going rustic or lodge or classic or 
contemporary or formal or anything else. I think it just goes with everything because the gold makes it go high and the wood makes it go more casual and it kind of just goes however you want it to go. Um, I love that you get two holders for the tea lights on those. By the way, don't forget that you can put these on another candle holder. That's what we're using as bases to get them different heights and that's always a fun idea. So don't be afraid to take your pillar candle holders and use them as stands for other things. So one of the prettiest, prettiest ways to do Christmas is going to be pink champagnes, peaches, apricots, metallics, beautiful soft white, and everything together. How could anything be prettier? It is an absolutely gorgeous way to do Christmas.